important for a product to be familiar, Filipino, 100% local, and totally world-class. Chef Guy the Forest approached me and suggested that why don't we come up with a Dalandan flavor. So after the launch, a lot of people came up to me and asked, what's next? We can't wait for the next product. It was a no-brainer. I was really intent on using raw materials unique and endemic to the Philippines. So I decided to give Dalandan a try. Tatlong pong mahigit na akong taon na ako'y namimitas. Pinili ko itong trabaho na ito para makatulong sa pamilya ko. Napakal ko ang pamilya ko, napag-aaral ko ang anak ko. Nakakaipon ng kunti para matustusan ko palalo yung pangangailangan. At isa kong marangal para sa aking hanap buhay ito. Ang ginagawa ko naman sa pamimitas ng sintores, ginakailangan nung meron kayong ganito. Ang tawagin nyo dito sa amin, panguko, para hindi ho masakit sa kukong tunay. Magamit kami yung tulad niya ng hagdan, ang tawagin namin ito. Balanan. Baka ho mamasa ang balat, mapait na ho kung kainin yan. Kinakailangan ho, madahan ho ilagay sa lalagyan. Mayroong medium, mayroong regular, mayroong yung reject nga, tiyatawag. Inalisin ho natin ang may sira, titiran ho natin ang magaganda para naman ho masihan ang bibili. It's sort of a CSR for our company. By paying the farmers market rate, we're able to substantially increase their margins, thereby encouraging them to go into farming in a bigger way. Also, it encourages the young generation to go into farming. I've been blessed with a few opportunities in recent years to be able to present Filipino cuisine and products abroad. And uh, being able to showcase the best from our country has always made me proud. But having encountered such products as Manil, Liqueur de Calamansi, and now Liqueur de Dalandan, I think that it has brought this advocacy of mine full circle. The Philippine Craft Spirits line was made because we wanted to expand the use of our crops here. Ako ay natutuwa dahil mayroong isang kumpanya na nag-iintals ngayon sa paggamit ng dalandan at saka kalamansi at kinoconvert nila into a liquor or inumin at sa proseso na yan, nakakaproduce sila ng isang ingredients na pulp na pwede natin gamitin as an ingredient also sa pagpuproduce ng isang cosmetic na produkto. At isa na nga ho dito ay ang sabon. So yan ang nakikita ko na isang magandang proseso na kung saan ang isang basura ay pwede mo pakunin at mapakinabangan at maging isang produkto. Manila Liqueur de Dalandan is the only liquor in the world that utilizes the essential oils of the fruit that captures the sweet, zesty profile of Dalandan.